Uh, sexual harassment is a predatory behavior. News since 6, the head of the rehab center where San Diego Mayor Bob Filner is believed to be undergoing his therapy program talks to 10 News about why two weeks won't be enough to cure Filner. Tonight, 10 News has learned that the clinic is in Beverly Hills and it specializes in sexual addictions. Good evening, I'm Steve Atkins. And I'm Maitika Milanis in for Kimberly Hunt. 10 News reporter Allison Ash spoke to the head of that clinic about how that program works. Multiple sources are telling 10 News that the mayor is just a 90 minute drive away from City Hall up in Los Angeles and 10 News has pinpointed the likely program and the spot where the mayor is getting that intensive treatment for his bad behavior with women. This is that place. It's called the Sexual Recovery Institute and it's on the second floor of this building we found pictured on Google Earth right above a waxing salon. Los Angeles TV station KNBC is reporting Bob Filner is being treated here, but the founder of the intensive therapy program told us via Skype he hasn't met or seen the mayor. He did not say whether any of his therapists were working with him. I think that it makes sense that we would be an obvious choice. Robert Weiss did talk about the affliction that Filner has been accused of, that being serial sexual harassment by more than a dozen women. Uh, sexual harassment is a predatory behavior. We actually look at it as in a sexual form of sexual offending. Weiss said his two-week intensive program helps patients control the emotional and physical triggers to their bad behavior. Therapy lasts eight hours a day, five days a week, and clients stay at a halfway house away from temptation. If this is someone who is in a position of power and they're used to having that power and they don't want to give up that power, that's going to be a big challenge for them because the people that I work with, they need to tune down their lives. They need to tone down their lives. Bob Filner has shown no desire to tune down his life, even though many of his former allies are calling for him to resign. He continues to say he won't step down. The mayor is still checking in with City Hall every morning and evening during these therapy sessions, and we're told he will be back in his office a week from Monday. From City Hall, Allison Ash, 10 News. And 10 News has learned a group is already planning a protest rally on the morning that Filner returns to work.